Uh, hello, this is Mr. Cad1997, and right now I'm going to show you a gameplay of just Slayer that I played. I wasn't recording when I played this, so it's not going to be a live commentary, but it's going to be good anyway. I I I assure you that this game will not be bad. <laughs> I hope you like that little part. <laughs> and right now, I'm in a party, and my friend is playing uh, this video. It's like Idiots of Gary's Mod. Oh, wait. I didn't mean to do that. There. Okay, sorry. It's Idiots of Gary's Mod or something like that. And it is just this ridiculous video, basically, where this guy, these guys just made this video of, like, random stuff on Gary's Mod, like, mixing together a bunch of funny videos, but making it, making the Gary's Mod characters do it. So it's really funny. And if you noticed, I use the pistol a lot more than the AR when I play Halo Reach, just because of the fact that it has far more accuracy, and it's about as good as the DMR, except it has a little less than the DMR, accuracy-wise. And it has the same damage and everything, just the clip size is a little smaller and the damage is lower. And right here, if you notice, I get out of there when I see all of those guys, and then I go back and get a better weapon. So, I'm like, whoa, and then I notice he has a rocket launcher, so I really don't have a chance right there. So, that was the end of me and that life. So far I have five kills, I'm in the lead on my team too, and I think the lead on my game, in the game. So sticky over there. I think I take down a shield more. I I think I did. I don't get any kills right here. I know that if I tried to kill all of them, I'd be overrun. So I stay back, do the smart thing, you know. Oh, my shield's down. Run away. Oh, that guy killed him. And, oh, and then I get sniped. Really, I mean, there wasn't a ton I could have done about that. I should have stayed back probably, but. Really, he they have a lot. They had a lot of the power weapons. And that is, did you see that guy with the energy sword back there? He just ran out sprinting, and uh, really, that's not always the best idea, especially when there's a ton of them. When you have the energy sword, it's just good mostly to not completely camp, but like just patrol an area with a couple of doors only so that you like you don't have 50 guys at once shooting at you from every angle so don't go out in the completely open areas when you have the energy sword and uh... with the pistol it takes four shots to the body and one to the head and you, you notice there i shot him with a grenade and then i shot him i think i die right here oh no wait yeah i die right here but i got out with three kills so that's always a plus then right away I switch to the pistol. Sorry, just adjusting the camera if you notice that shaking. Yeah, okay, I got that person. And that was really annoying right there. I stuck the guy, and he went towards my teammate, and it killed my teammate, and it counted as a betrayal. I don't think that should count. I think that should only count as a kill against him, you know? Uh, anyway, that's how that happened. Just pummeled him. Go grenade. 
Double kill. Really a good idea. Uh, yeah. And, uh, there's not, I don't really have many viewers, but tell me if you want to see any Left 4 Dead videos, because I can do Left 4 Dead anytime, you know? And that game, I, I really think it's fun. The only thing is, you have to have a good team, otherwise you will suck, especially if you're playing as the zombies. As the humans, it's kind of okay to have randoms. But really, you you want to be in a party because otherwise, you know you're you're going one at a time. You know you like you have your hunters going. <laughs> you have like one hunter going, and then he gets killed, and then a smoker grabs someone, he gets killed. You know you don't really want that. I like that little double kill because that guy had <laughs> the energy sword and I just had a pistol, but I killed him, you know? Really, that, that just shows you the pistol is a good weapon. And don't underestimate it. And then right there, his shield was down, so I switched to the AR and took him out because I just wanted to get a quick, easy, to, easy kill. Wasn't trying to go for anything amazing. And here, I completely mess up. I almost assassinated that person, but I failed and I died myself. And right there, I had no chance. I was going up against three guys, you know. One of the guys already took down my shield a little bit, I killed him, you know. And there's still two guys left. My shield's already down. You really don't have much of a chance. Right there, I'm just trying to survive. My health is low, so I run away. That probably wasn't the best decision, but it didn't actually turn out to be the worst thing ever. I actually survived and did pretty well. Get, I got, oh, no, nope, I didn't get that person. I thought I would have. And I don't know what I did there. I just betrayed betrayed that person. I didn't even mean to. I, I just kind of, as a reaction, I <laughs> pummeled. I was like, whoa. And then those guys were just throwing grenades like crazy. And at the end of the game, I got 30 kills. Yeah. So, yep. Yeah, that's how the game ended. I don't actually know how many deaths I got. Wait, I wonder if it says... Um, well, anyway, I'm going to end that film, and I get, I wonder if I can check to see how many kills I got that game. Just a second. I will check. My friend's watching that video still. But, yeah, let me see if I can check that. Um, it was my last game I played. Um, uh, what is it? Doesn't look like I'm, I can do that. Usually it says you can push some, like, one of the things to, uh, check where your score was the last game, but it doesn't seem like I can. So, yeah, I guess I can't do that. But, uh, anyway... Mr. Cod 1997 out. I got 30 kills, but I don't know how many deaths I got. But still, my team won. 30 kills is very impressive, in my opinion, for Halo. That was just normal Slayer. I was using the pistol mostly. Uh, yeah, so Mr. Cod 1997 is out right now.